Hey guys, Raven here. Today we are in my kitchen and we are going to be cleaning my oven. The oven needs to be clean. I haven't cleaned in a little while, but I'm going to be using some natural products. I usually will just go and spray it with some chemical spray and see what happens. But today I'm going to be using my, it's actually supposed to be um, regular vinegar, but I'm going to be using apple cider vinegar. The rags, good stuff and some baking soda and some water and a sponge so we're gonna see how this works yeah so let's get started by first showing you so, the oven. let me show you that's what the oven looks like right now oh we have some food that fell down there and this is like the main part i'm really concerned about so yeah but this it doesn't seem as bad as it actually could be so this is the oven and what we're working on so what do is I am going to be um I'm going to mix this cider vinegar right okay I don't know if it's gonna work because it's not real like the distilled vinegar because I don't have any of that I don't know why I don't have any and I'm gonna use this baking soda and I'm gonna mix it up the directions say that you're supposed to leave it in the oven um on 100 in a oven safe um dish for an hour check out those bags under those eyes anyway i have no makeup on this morning um um so yeah that's what we're gonna do i'm gonna do that and then on the harder to like clean areas you're gonna put the solution directly on those areas set the oven to 100 degrees for an hour come back and wipe it away so let's see if this is going to work using this dish right here okay and I'm going to get the mother in there. Like I said, I don't know if this is actually going to work because, yeah. So I'm going to fill this cup up full of vinegar. That's thinking. Above what it's supposed to be, and it's supposed to sit in here for an hour. So, Alexa, mm. set a timer for one hour. One hour, starting now. And we will be back after the hour to finish up the job.
I got to this last part, I only could scrub clean the um, bottom part of the glass with the vinegar and um, the vinegar and baking soda um, solution. I did not like how the um, area was coming out, so I went ahead and I got a Mr. Clean Magic Eraser, and it started to do a great job. Um, I'm not sure if I should have, if the solution I had just wasn't strong enough, if I should have put more vinegar, if I should have had a, um, the distilled vinegar or not, but yeah, it didn't work the way I wanted it to. So right here you see me spraying the method, um, surface cleaner just to give the oven a clean shine. As you also can see, I am not happy with the outside where the glass is. I am just like, I'm not sure. I think I have to go back and try another method, no pun intended, um, for the outside. So I put it inside and now I'm spraying the surface with a um, method cleaner. The, um, oh my gosh, I can't remember what the name of it is. Um, it's not like your basic surface cleaner though, and I'm using a cloth diaper. Um, I use cloth diapers a lot at home. I got, I had a, I cloth diaper my babies, and I also had, I um, went to a, um, oh my goodness, I went to a, um, good job, Raven. <laughs> I went to yard, a yard sale, and I got a whole bunch of them, so I love cleaning with these, and I just throw them in the wash when I'm done. I'm going in and cleaning, um, getting all the grid, and it's coming out very, very good. find a better method to clean the, I don't know if you can see them, but the rings around the hot areas of the, uh, of the, where you put the pots at, like the burn marks. I really would like to find something to get rid of that. But I just went in and I just shined it all up and it made it look very, very presentable and pretty. And I am very happy with how it came out. I am very, very happy I just not happy with the inside but yeah everything else came out very very well now here I am I if you watch my dollar store haul which I will link below I got this bowl and these rocks from um, the Dollar Tree and I am going to place my candle that I got from um, Bath and Body Works for their um, their little sale they had, and I am going to place the candle inside of the rock ever so slightly, <laughs> and yeah, I'm gonna set the um, light the candles. It's a um, peach flavor flavor, a peach scent. I like peach a lot. I've bought I want to say three of them, three different peach variations because they are my favorite. Yeah. was my clean with me oven tutorial um if you notice actually <laughs> i meant to say something about this earlier but um the first part of the video was taken in the morning i went to church i came home and i completed um the oven so it was done in the same day it's just two different outfits and the second part of the video i had a little bit of makeup on but yeah um i it took me a little longer than i wanted it to be
so thank you all for watching my clean with me oven edition i hope that it was a help for you and it will help you and motivate you to clean your oven and if you have any recommendations on how i could have did a better job or to get rid of those burn marks on the top of my oven please leave a recommendation in the comment section below again thank you so much for watching this clean with me and i will see you guys next time have a great day